National STEM Day. STEM stands for science, technology, engineering, and math. These four subjects are so important because they teach our kids critical thinking skills, assist them in problem solving, and instill a passion for innovation, which is all very important. We're celebrating with a fun science experiment you can do at home with your kiddos tonight. Challenge accepted, I heard it. Uh, to prove it, we've got three of our staffers' kids right here, Scarlett and twins Damien and Darrell. Give it up! y'all are here. Are you ready to have some fun? Yeah! yeah. All right. I'm really excited. All right. Me too. Me too. I'm All right. Well, to walk us through <laughs> to walk us through today's experiment, we've got TikTok's favorite teacher, Philip Cook, better known as Kim Teacher Phil. Give it up for Kim Teacher Phil. Hello. Great it's to nice to have you. Thanks for having me. Yeah, absolutely. So why do you think the STEM subjects are so important for our kids? I think that's where the jobs are going to be. And we want kids that are creative, innovative, and can solve problems, and STEM helps them do that. Absolutely, all right. Well, what are we, what are we learning today? So today we're gonna do a little experiment okay. about covalent bonds and covalent temperature. Bonds. And we're going to see what we can do. You I often see. talk about covalent bonds, just yeah. all, all the time. Just a minute ago, covalent we were backstage. bonds. We were just talking covalent about bonds. it. Yeah. yeah, I'm just like covalent bonds. It's so cool. We were talking about it. Um, so, so how do we get started? <laughs> to get started, you need a few supplies. You need white paper. You need a hair dryer, a can of dusting spray, and a special pen. These are pens that you can get from pretty much any office supply store. Burr, burr, burr. They're pilot friction erasable pens. And they're the first and only pens to be authenticated by stem.org. Okay, well we know all about these pens, sir. <laughs> so with Thanksgiving around the corner, we asked the kids to draw what they're most thankful for. So what did, what did you draw? What'd you do up here? Is this a bouncy house? Yes. That's cool. What are you thankful for? I'm thankful for my um, um, birthday party. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, I love that it. A few days ago. Oh, that's amazing. You get presents. Yes. Like, yeah. I also wrote, um, I also wrote this right here. Party. Yeah, because it's my birthday party. I party, like it. Party party because it's my birthday party. Uh, good, good handwriting. That's all I'm saying, too. <laughs> um, well, you. Scarlett, how about you? I drew my family. I drew my dog. I drew my mom and my dad and my baby sister. And I drew us all in, up in the mountains. So hard working for me. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. I like the mountains. Um, so now what do we do? So what we're going to do is take advantage of Pilot Friction's pen Thermochromic Ink. Okay. It's ink that's going to respond to temperature changes. Okay. So we're going to take the hair dryers that we have in front of us. Okay, I'll take the hair dryers. And we're going to turn them on high, and we're going to heat up the ink and see what happens. Okay. Oh, hi. So you want to this? Okay, here we go. Wow. And hold it close to the paper. If you hold it close, the ink will start oh to gosh. disappear. Oh, my gosh. Do you see it? Oh Right there. It's disappearing. <laughs> Look, your gift is going to disappear. Okay, so if we're, if we're erasing it, how do we make it reappear? Can you do yeah, that? So here, if we, if we turn this off just a second, the heat that we added caused the molecules to break covalent bonds. And okay. when that Look happens, you see that the ink, the color goes away and disappears. Look. Oh my gosh. Okay, oh. so what do we, oh, now it's real gone. Now it disappeared, like real good. So wait, so we spray this, is this what this is for? So this has actually got a liquid that will be very, very cold. So when we spray this liquid out of the dusting can spray, it should cool the ink back down and allow those covalent bonds to form oh, again. See, it's gone right here. Do you shake it or no? I've had best results when I turn it upside down a little bit. Oh, okay. So I like that trick. You're gonna just have to experiment and okay. see what works best. Okay. You wanna try it? I think mine. How, how about, how do you do it? Oh. Mine <laughs> by the color here. I know, well I didn't do, I, I was trying to like. Oh. No, wait, it's I'll coming back. I'll hold it a little bit. Oh, yeah, it's actually it's coming back. It's coming back. That was like that a minute ago. Yeah. Because remember, what? we didn't look like, watch. <laughs> oh, yeah! Oh! <laughs> Are you serious? I love it. I love it. What do you think, scientists? That's a pretty cool trick. Yeah, I want to be a scientist, uh, that, too. That's it. I know. That'd be cool. I think that's what? cool. Thank <laughs> you so much, Kim Teacher Phil. Look You're at welcome. it. Look at that. It's back. Pretty good, right? Whoa! I love it. That was so Bond is. <laughs> <laughs>
I totally knew about covalent bonds. Um, if you know a middle school or high school student who's making a difference through their passion for STEM, nominate them, please, for the new science fiction STEM grant. Five students will be awarded a total of $50,000 to further their STEM studies. Visit FrictionStim.com to learn more and submit your handwritten nomination before January 15th. And also be sure to pick up some Pilot Friction Erasable pens that go to the the Kelly Clarkson Show so you can do this experiment as well. Reba McIntyre's performing next, y'all. We'll be right back. Great job.